there, counselor. You're looking pretty good there. Well, thank you. Let me return the compliment. <laughs> Sammy, good to see you are working out those postpartum pounds. You know, that baby fat, it's not your friend. Wow, Nicole, not surprising to see you with a bottle of water in your hand. I hope it's sewer water. Do you not care at all about the environment? Sure I care. I just have better things to do with my time than worry about it. Lucas and I had a green wedding. Are you sure he wasn't just green around the gills because he realized that he went ahead and married you? Oh, oh, you know what? I have a theory on why Lucas shot EJ. You know, Nicole, I really, uh, I don't think we need to hear that. No, believe me, I understand. Nobody wants to hear that their husband opted to go to prison instead of getting back together with his wife. And that the sex in prison was probably better. You know, EJ, if I were you, I would watch out. If you're not careful, you're going to be walking that fuzzball Nicole calls a dog. All right, okay, okay. Guys, that just, that's just, please, let's just not, all right? Let's go EJ, on. this is not about you. This is between me and her. I have had it with both of you. I need a sauna to get rid of all the toxins in the air from being around you. You know, just because we're technically husband and wife does not mean you get to dictate my day to me. Look, Samantha, all I was suggesting is that it would be a good idea for the twins to get some fresh air. And I am not interested in helpful hints from someone who's only ever babied a high-powered hybrid engine. Well, at least we both agree about protecting the environment. Unfortunately, that is not a qualification for father of the year. Oh, come on. Don't you dare begin to attack my paternal instincts. I'm a good father. This doesn't have anything to do with how good you are with the kids. This is about how little you know about me. No, <clears throat> Lucas and I used to squabble like that. I hope your makeup sex is as good as ours was. <gasps> Not possible. Well, I hope you're billing her for this, EJ. I should be billing him for marriage counseling. <laughs> I didn't realize you were a member here. I bet that makes you wish you were still a drunk, huh? <laughs> oh, my God. Wow. That was not okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm, I'm bad. I'm just, I was just kidding. Ladies, all right, just please, please, the two to of you. Hey. Hey. Oh. hey. Hey, you. Thanks. Hey. I really enjoyed working out with you today. Oh, you know what? You really gave me a workout. Hey, <laughs> this is my personal trainer, Jillian. Oh, Pookie used to have a trainer, too. Pookie? Mm, my dog. Uh... I pushed you really hard today, and you did absolutely amazing. <gasps> Ain't no gain, right? <laughs> These days, we like to say, no investment, no return. And it looks like your assets are bottoming out. Oh, honey, there ain't nothing wrong with these assets. <clears throat> you got one hell of a nerve. So I've been told. You are sadly mistaken if you think for one second I'm going to run to my daddy and tell him to do anything on your say-so. John has ruined your father's job and reputation. I guess I didn't think either one of you wanted things to get any worse. If he keeps hitching his future to John, things will get much worse. Well, I am, I am pretty comfortable with the treadmill and the uh -huh. stair climber and uh, the resistance machine. And, um, and I do some yoga. Uh-huh. But that resistance workout you gave me was a killer. It was a killer. Yeah. Uh, you got to suck it up and you got to stick with it. Because it's the best thing for your cardiovascular endurance, your muscle tone, and your overall health in general. So I think we're going to see huge changes if you keep it up over the next couple of weeks in your physical stamina. Okay. I'm all for that. So, <laughs> you two happen to have some morning sessions available if you're interested. Well, actually, I um, signed up and I'll, I'll be sign. thinking about it. No, you won't, but you should. Ooh, my body's fine. That's because you're young, but it's up to you to keep it that way. Age is going to take its toll. You gotta stay hydrated, you gotta sleep, you have to eat right and work out. So she hydrates, she drinks two quarts of something a day. What, vodka, gin? Really, who asked Both? you? You gotta use it or lose it, honey. 
And I never thought I'd say this, but uh, you should consider eating something too thin, not hot. I'll catch you later, Smalls. Oh! <laughs> you too, Slim. Oh! Could she be a bigger loser? Well, yeah, if she were you. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, wait, something I said? You truly are unbelievable. Thank you. Mm. Um, EJ. Hey. Can you have some time to go over some things about my divorce case? Uh, yeah, we could spare a few minutes. Well, you should. Your time is my money. Well, if you'll excuse me, I'm gonna go shower, change, and get back to the restaurant. Hey, Maggie, before we go, sorry. I, um, I just wanted to offer my congratulations at you getting your certification from the Green Restaurant Association. Oh, does that mean you'll be serving Irish food instead of French? Or is it just that everything is rancid? It means that uh, they've achieved certain environmental standards in preparing the food, storing the food, and cleaning products and so on. Anyway, congratulations. Thank really you. And a whole lot more. I'm, I'm going to talk to Carolyn soon about doing the same thing with the pub. Oh, wonderful. Yeah. Don't they serve green beer once a year already? I mean, shouldn't that be enough? You know, some people care, Nicole. Obviously, you don't. <sighs> Avoid deportation. So what are these? It's glass, Nicole. They're uh, washable, reusable as opposed to disposable and wasteful. Hmm. What a pain. You know, next time remind me to bring my flask. Juice without vodka is like a day without sunshine. Mm -mm. Okay. Um, are we done? Can I go back to my workout? Sure. Anything to stop the ticking money clock. <laughs> well, the meeting was your idea. I just wanted to know what the next step was in extricating myself from Victor <clears throat> and Victor from his money. Okay, the next step is to begin preliminary divorce proceedings. Right, will he be there? I would not expect him to be there, no. It's pretty much a formality, just filing paperwork. Mm. Well, as long as he's there when the judge grants the divorce decree, I want to watch Victor bleed money. Look, Nicole, you do understand that uh, this is not cut and dried. I mean, Victor is going to do everything that he can in order to stop you from walking away with even a penny. Hmm. Let him try. He will. And he'll lose, and you'll make sure of that, won't you? I will do my very best. I know you will. I will, mostly because if I do, I'm going to walk away with a pretty penny. Mm-hmm. Well, getting rid of Victor will be worth every one of those pennies. Are we done here? Yes, we are. Excuse me, how much you going to go and check on the twins? Enjoy the rest of your working, man. Thanks. I'm a busy man, Paul. I guess I just never thought my future would play out this way. Well, life happens when you least expect it. You just have to be up for the challenge. It's definitely challenging. Life just got a little nastier. You stay away from my children. What's your problem, Sammy? You act like I have some kind of disease. Don't, okay? Just don't. Look, I am the only one who is authorized to take them out of the daycare. No, you're not. So, what's got your thong in a twist? Okay, that's enough. You want children? Get your own. Or, or play house with your little fuzz ball. I'm sorry, sweetheart. Thanks for nothing, Nicole. Make her cry. Look, I don't... This is your final warning, Nicole. You stay away from my children or you will regret it. I don't know what the big deal is, Sammy. How would you feel if I took little Yip Yip out for a walk? A long walk. Would you really feel safe? Oh, please. That's hardly the same thing. You're right. Because they're my children. And I get to control who they are with and who they are not with. EJ, I am serious. I don't want them ever near this thing again. Get a life, Sammy. I don't even know which brat I was holding anyway. Excuse me? I don't know if it was EJ's or Lucas's. Good thing you didn't have triplets. Can't tell the fathers without a program. Whoa, 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 whoa. Easy, easy, oh easy. Come on, hey, come on. Okay. Uh, hey, come on. Can I sue her no, for that? No, you can't sue her. You I'm provoked her. All right, let's just leave it. Then I'll get a restraining order. Oh, don't waste your time. I don't want to be anywhere near you ever again. Huh. Man, I hope this doesn't bruise. I have a date with John Black tonight.
Did she just just my mother's she's husband? She's whining. Just let it go. She's winding you up. Just no, let no, it no. go. Nicole asked for it. She is going to get it.